Hey guys, it's Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to episode 11 of Ascendants of a Bookworm, but before we get started, um, okay, so two things. One, I am sorry this didn't come out yesterday. Um, as I said in my Orsuki video, and I will also be saying in, um, After School Dice Club, the reason why will be in the comments below. I'm just gonna say that. And another thing, I did find this out, uh, last... Thursday? I think it was Thursday or Friday when we found out because I was up at like 7, 8 o'clock in the morning um, and everything and I saw something on Twitter. This show officially got a season two but the saddest thing is like I was thinking, I was like okay since it's got a season two and everything I was like this is gonna come out in winter right because winter is relatively known for a lot of sequels and not a lot of um mainly me about like maybe 10 original shows or newer shows coming out that don't have to do with the sequel at all but no it's actually coming in spring so I i'm really excited i hope that however they're going to end this show because we are really really close i think we have like two more weeks left before we're, we're done with this show completely for now um i think what i would possibly want them to do is essentially possibly end the show in a cliffhanger and then just be like hey to be continued in spring 2020 where maybe I don't want the last episode where it was like last week where she fainted because she you know the devouring controlled her even more and then it's just like to be continued and then you're sitting here I'm sitting here and I'm just like I don't like this and the fact is that I'll have to wait until spring to find out what happens but I want it to kind of mm, end on a good note in a way because from the um the poster art it's her and it's the freaking high priest so in these like i think last two or three episodes that, no two episodes that we have left um i just really 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 times a thousand want her and the high priestess to officially meet i don't want to see no more of the end of the episode and they're both there getting ready to say like kind of the not really a preview of like the next episode but just talking and stuff i need them both in the episode in their art style talking that's what i've been wanting ever since kind of really episode one because he was essentially in episode one i mean that was like i i binged and caught up with this show like so freaking quickly that I mean it's been a while and because of the fact is that I watched so many freaking stuff that I really I, I kind of remember it but then at the same time I don't because yeah I've watched so much stuff like this past year and three years and you think I'm gonna remember something from like 11 weeks ago possibly not other than that guys let's go ahead and get started with episode 11 in three two one go It's just sad that even that she was excited about something, it still took over her because it's mainly whether she gets upset or angry about something and not excitement, but it's just coming a lot quicker now. And I don't like this, even though we know from that poster for season two, she's going to be okay. But it's just the biggest thing I want to know is the devouring situation. I don't think there's like, and I, I think I said this a couple of weeks ago, um, essentially when we finally learn, learned the name of it, what it was and everything, uh, there's no cure for it because um, the guild master's uh, daughter, or no, granddaughter has it. And if there was, she would possibly be cured by now. Maybe. But I'm kind of hoping that like with season two, depending on how long maybe they want this series to go and how long the light novels is because probably once I officially read this series, if you can see this, the didn't I say to make my abilities average to the next life, maybe by book three or book four, um, because I bought all three for my birthday. Mm, I might read this show. I'm not too sure. 100% completely and stuff but i really want to know kind of the differences between the anime and the book and see if there's like 
little things. Because didn't I say to make a, <laughs> make my abilities average in the next life is very, very different. I'm only really on chapter two. I haven't read in a while, but from what I've read, it is completely different. There's some similarities to the anime and the light novel, but there's other things that are so different. I just want to know. Oh, that's a bracelet that I don't think I can take all of it away though. Nope. So what exactly was that bracelet? That's good. Mm -hmm. So the br okay. For now, though. Mm hmm So you still have a lot to worry about. Who knows? Oh my god!
That's a hard question. But she may never be able to see her family again. But see, would the high priestess be considered a noble? Well, yeah, he has to be. Mm -hmm. Of course, because you still are going on this. You want to make a cake or something? A pound cake. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> you it's just sell this. <laughs> You have that all planned out, don't you? I 
But let me guess, you fell asleep. <laughs> Mm -mm. <laughs> oh, I mean, a little. <laughs> <laughs> Even though you probably wanted to go back to your own time. Oh, well, of course he was. Mine is like his prized possession in a way. Yeah, how rare, sugar. Mm, yeah, I mean, honestly, in this day and age of this world and the way this anime has taken place, honestly, really, everything seems so rare. Like, really important things. <laughs> I can't imagine, like, how much... Oh, God, I don't know. I can't think. Like, uh, if electricity existed, electricity would probably be hella expensive. But freaking sugar? Like, oh my god. And a year goes by so quickly, man. And it's just, it's just gonna haunt her for the rest of this episode, or really the rest of this season. You sit on the day. Oh, 
Bro, that means we're finally gonna be able to see what it looks like inside and everything. Oh my god. The heavens. The hills are alive. A lot. They got coins. That fucking hurt. Oh my god. I right, see, I felt like in a way when she said, Can I stay with my family right here right now? In a way, it felt like she kind of already made her decision that she's okay with staying with her family and then in a year from now eventually passing on. But with that poster, I don't think it's gonna be like that. There's gonna be a point where maybe herself, her mother or father, or even Tully will eventually say, I think it's better for you to go live with a noble and be with a noble. And then eventually it's going to be the high priestess. It might be the high priestess, not priestess. Um, it's a possibility we might actually see him 
next week officially. I'm not 100% sure, but because of the fact is that we do have two episodes left with this show, what else is there to do? I'm guessing the following episode would be her baptism, possibly. If it's not episode 12, it would maybe be the finale of the show. But my God, I did not think, I thought she was going to wait a while to tell them, but in a way she really needed to tell her family because to keep something so secretive as that, so dark as that, I mean, that would have hurt. I know it, it just, she needed to do it, but then at the same time, I, I get it why she didn't, she waited until now to say it because she didn't want them to get upset about it, you know? Baptisms, yes! <laughs> oh, yeah. Mm. Yeah, because honestly, think about that. If she possibly goes to live with a nobleman, how is she going to be able to do her work and selling and getting money and stuff like that? I think, you know, maybe the, the nobleman, if it is the high priest, um, will essentially still let her have a job because essentially it seemed like she was still working when she was around the high priest in the first episode before they did like, okay, here's the flashback. Here's where it's going to start, you know. I, I don't know. I mean, because with two episodes left, I feel like there's still a lot of missed information that we haven't relatively seen yet. And I think when we get season two in spring, I think it'll maybe um, answer some questions that I have about this show. But I think at the same time, I, I feel like there's going to be one person who's probably either like, one or two things might happen. Somebody is going to be nice and they're going to explain as much as they can because there have been some people relatively coming in and saying um, things that if I didn't understand, someone's right there and stuff. Or two, I may have to start reading the series a lot earlier than I expected and then trying to like catch up with the show. But then at the same time, if I read it, then I'll probably know things that are going to happen in the second season. So if I possibly know up where season one essentially ends for the book then I'll read up until wherever season one ends and then when season two starts um and ends then I'll continue but then if it gets another season then it's like I'm screwed <laughs> but I mean it was a really really good heartwarming episode and something that we really really need especially after last week because last week was very heartbreaking with that ending with that cliffhanger on the ending and everybody knows that I can't stand cliffhangers so at the same time I'm just like bruh I, I can't do this anymore and <sighs> this show always brings me back whether it's emotional feelings or just like mine how adorable she is and then the help of Frida today like oh my god because can you imagine like if Frida didn't if mine didn't have that bracelet on she would have been dead by now Maybe, I'm not 100% sure, but it, it's a, mm, it's there, probably a little percentage. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 11 of Ascendance of a Book Room. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like, it really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel, I make videos every single day. Join the Metro Squad, and of course, I will see you guys officially all next Wednesday for episode 12. Once again, I am so sorry that this did not come out Wednesday. Um, I promise, I hope. Because it depends. Because, like I said, when you see that comment of why this didn't come out yesterday, um, I'm just hoping that by next Wednesday, I do essentially have the time to record not only this, but some other shows that are coming out Wednesday. But with things, good things that are coming for me, I don't know if I will. I, I, I might have to postpone it for like a, maybe a day or a two despite but i'm not really gonna know until maybe next wednesday but until then i will see you guys all next time bye